These cattle are precious, cherished by the people of South Sudan. They are a source of status and wealth. Sold for cash, slaughtered for cultural practices, buttered for grain and given away as dowries. In a country where livestock outnumber the human population, families rely on these animals for survival. They live off the milk and meat and use the money from trading them to send their children to school. However, they have also traditionally been a source of conflict with cattle raiding common throughout the region. The intercommunal conflict worsened here in Bentu in northern South Sudan with the outbreak of civil war in 2013 causing widespread devastation and loss of life. The animals were not spared either. Local veterinary services were wiped out with farmers finding it impossible to access vaccinations and treatment for their stock. Before the crisis, we have been having uh, clinics around the town, having veterinary drugs, and also the ministry was fully functional. But after the crisis, we, 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 we have that gap of, we don't have veterinary clinics in the town anymore. And also, we don't have uh, staff, enough staff. On the outskirts of Bentu is Bempu Cattle Camp. It is home to hundreds of longhorn cattle. But many of these animals have been dying because of untreated diseases. I think it's just a cut. Mm. A cut. And I don't see anything. Yeah, there one. Some bruises. Yes. Yeah, there. Huh? And it's being infested. Yep. <laughs> infested so. Dr. Richard Ose Apadu is a veterinarian serving with the United Nations Mission in South Sudan as part of the Ghanaian Peacekeeping Battalion. He's been working alongside vet technicians and local herdsmen to vaccinate and treat the cattle, as well as training them to care for the animals themselves. They tell me what they need, and that is why I'm here. So I have to provide the services to them. So till I finish what I'm doing, if I don't finish, it means I don't go home. I have to be with them, do everything before I leave here. So they are wonderful people, and I wish to even not even go home, to stay with them and work with them for a long time, yes, to help them. This kind of assistance may not be core work for the peacekeeping mission, but it helps reduce conflict between cattle herders which in turn protects local people from violence and helps build durable peace. Apart from uh, the, 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 the veterinary services, there are so many help they have been given to us, uh, especially supporting the returnees, uh, integrating them and, uh, and, 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 and supporting, supporting them and coordinating uh, between us, the government, and the other agencies. The groups are committed to working together in the hope that in future they can enjoy a peaceful and prosperous life together.